Samuel from Set Hub, and today I'm here to present to you none other than the heavyweight champion of the <laughs> perfume world, Blue de Chanel perfume oil type. You know, Blue de Chanel. You know, this perfume oil type is like the best seller of all times. You know, it's the most bad perfume. Uh, in my per in my um, experience, it's the most bad perfume from Scent Hack. You know, and um, for me personally, it's the most complimented perfume that I've had of all time. You know, um, when I had you know different perfumes, actually my first experience at time when I started into the fragrance journey, I had um, Polo Blue, and I had this, and I had um, I had Spice Bomb too as well. You know, but I wanted a different times different stages and this one was the most complimented all time i remember I, I was at work and um you know this my co-worker asked me you know what well, you smell very nice the other day like what are you wearing you know uh in the house when i leave the house um you know i have people ask me anytime i walk past it's like i would get unsolicited compliments left and right you know um man this thing is a beast like I have, you know, this is so far, it's like one of the, it's the most complimented um, perfumery type in my collection, you know, in my collection, Blue de Chanel. Um, so when I smiled it, my first impression was very nice, you know, this was very nice. When you smell perfumery type and you have sort of words and all you think of very nice, it's like you have really nailed it, you know, you have found, you have found your partner, you know, you have found something that will like, be one of your signature um, perfume or perfume oil types you know so i did got nutmeg you know i got nutmeg but then i also had mint so mint nutmeg and lime you know those notes were kind of like beautifully beautifully and romantically crafted together you know to form this beautiful nice smell you know and to seal it off, it also has ginger in it, you know. So think about nutmeg, ginger, <laughs> lime, and mint. These four musketeers, <laughs> like all put together in one place. But it's not like they are both. They are all screaming at you and yelling at you, and um, all over the place. But they are working together in the, in the most beautiful, synchronized fashion. Um, to be, give you this nice, f fresh, clean, you know, you know, um, yet, you know, spicy smell. You know, it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. It's like you have to try it. Um, you know, I'm just trying to do my best, you know, <laughs> to, to um, explain it. But I know my best will still not be enough for this particular Blue Chanel type. You know, you have to like definitely get it. It's like it's the most complimentary of all times. Um, the notes, however, if you look at the notes, um, you could realize that it has, besides the things that I mentioned, it also has sandalwood, patchouli, jasmine, grapefruit, vetiver, incense, cedar, and um, pink pepper. You know, so most people have gotten the pink pepper from it. Um, some people will get the grapefruit as well. Um, vetiver. The, the patchouli was silenced. There's no patchouli. I did not get any patchouli from it at all. It was, to me, it was so very, very silent, if there was. And then the sandalwood, you know, those notes I didn't get at all. You know, it was just, like, like I said, the interplay of the nutmeg, mint, lime, and maybe the grape, the grapefruits, you know. It is so beautiful, you know. So, just a quick presentation of the bottle. Like I always do for my new viewers. It's... Um, 0 0.033 ounce bottle and it's a roll on that you could apply um, on yourself based on you know the season or based on um, what's going on in general but I would say th this one you could apply you know projection is good you know like I said you 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 get uns unsolicited um, compliments you know so just be careful, you know, so it wouldn't be like just too much, you know, so maybe for all applications, um, you know, be light on it. This thing will be great in summertime, you know, summer, spring is great, you know, 
great for those um, seasons. Um, it's very versatile, you know, as well. It's, um, you know, young people could wear it, older people could wear it. Um, it's more saying get all the clubby young young people vibe, but I pretty much think, you know, believe that anybody could leave and pull away with it. Women as well, you know, like I said, this thing, women love this thing, <laughs> you know, it's like, it's like, um, women really appreciate men, like, when you wear this thing, it's just, you're just gonna get, you just, I mean, you don't wear it for the women, but you wear it for yourself in general, as I always say with perfume, but be aware, you know, be aware, because <laughs> women are gonna have all sort of bad thoughts about you, like, in a good way, you know, it's like, people, women love this thing, um, because you'll be clean, you'll be nice, you'll be, you'll be mysterious, you know, and you'll be very inviting, you know, and women are gonna definitely gonna appreciate you more. Totally love this smell, totally, totally love this smell uh, to death. Uh, for longevity, this thing could last you the whole day, you know, it could last the whole day, so it's good on longevity. Uh, it's, 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 it's also okay with projection, you know, it's okay with projection, like I said, it's, it gets you the compliments, you know, so get, it definitely, and it will get you the compliment, no doubt about that. For uniqueness, I would say this is not very unique in my collection, but <laughs> the uniqueness in, in, is in how they use the, um, the notes, you know, how they use the notes, so um, how they blend the notes and how it comes out for, you know, so in a way, the sound of the notes are there's no notes are familiar but then how they blend the notes and how it projects is where lies the uniqueness you know so it could go either way i want to say it's unique it, it's um <laughs> it's not unique but it's also um comes off unique in a certain way you know so like the notes and stuff are not unique but it is a very nice smell <laughs> you know it's you know it's, it's hard to wrap your head around it but i hope that makes sense to you you know for versatility like i said it's very versatile smell you definitely could wear it anywhere um this is definitely like a must have in your collection um like i, I could guarantee that you know it's like i remember when i got it it's like i used it so quickly i had to order like a new batch you know right away you know so it's like i don't know bloody chanel um, well made, well made perfume oil type. You know, so you can definitely grab this from sensehunt.com. Uh, let me know where you got from it. Like I said, there was other notes in it, like the patchouli, the pink pepper, cedar incense. It even has incense in it. You know, but to me, like I said, the four bad boys. You know, was mainly what I got from it. So let me know where you got from it. Um, how it did. You know, the projection, how did your skin. Whether you got any compliments, which. <laughs> I shouldn't even be asking that, but let me know overall, like, what you got from it, your take on uh, Bloody Chanel. Leave a comment below, like, comment, subscribe, but make sure you subscribe, share this video, uh, make sure you subscribe, because that's the only way you get my videos when they do come out. Take care, and until next time.